the new news, she's slaying the city. No makeup, just wake up and still giving the free. Get the lights, camera, and she cuts as big as a movie. And grab a seat and now tune with disastrous beauty. unit 
So this is a unit, it says wig deets. It has the hair length is 12 inches. The density is 180. The color is as image and the lace color is transparent. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on the link Okay, so once I click on the link, it says Pink Skunk Stripe Body Wave Bob 13 by 6 Lace Front Wig. Uh, this unit is available in 12, 14, and 16 inches. As I mentioned, I do have it in 12 inches. Uh, I definitely prefer it in this particular length, but you can get it in 12, 14, or 16. I have it in 180, but it's also available in 150. And um, yeah, it's also available in 150% density. And yeah, that is pretty much it as far as the details and specs that I see. Uh, yeah. So, now with this particular unit, as I stated, it basically came pre-styled. Uh, it's a body wave wig, so once you wash it, it's not going to have as many curls as you guys seen when I took it out of the packaging. Uh, I did decide not to bleach the knots because, in my opinion, it was not needed. You can tell me if you think it was needed or not, girl, but I didn't feel like it was needed. Uh, I do also want to mention that I did see some uh, stains on the lace underneath, which will happen sometimes when you are coloring hair or whatever, but I do want to go ahead and point it out. Uh, and yeah, this unit was also pre-tweezed, so it was basically pre-styled, pre-tweezed, and it bleaching was not needed, okay? So I want to throw all of that out there, and it came pre-colored. But yeah, so I, I do want to go ahead and point out all of those facts with this unit. Now, as far as shedding and tangling, I did not receive any. It is a short bob body way so i did not expect any of that okay so in my opinion this particular unit is big head friendly i am an average cap size so girl do what you want to do but i did have to adjust the strap so when i have to adjust the strap then i deem a unit to be big head friendly but once again do with that what you want to do with that and yeah that is pretty much it as far as the details and specs go now if you're interested in my pros and cons as well as the full 360 then please continue to watch okay so you guys know i like to start with the cons because i like to end on a high note as far as cons go with this particular unit, the only con that I could think of is that some of the lace was colored. But as you guys can see, even right here in this area, it was colored. It still doesn't, it, it doesn't really make that big of a difference. Well, not for me, <laughs> it, but it is a con in general. I know that, you know, some people can be definitely thrown off by that. I personally was not, but, and it also does bleed a little bit because, any unit that I get like this that has this sort of color, it does bleed a little bit. So I would recommend washing it prior to applying it and, you know, just kind of like, you know, maybe getting rid of some of that excess color. But that is also a con. So those are my cons with this wig. Now, as far as the pros, first of all, the pre-tweezing of it, okay, the pre-coloring of it, uh, the the no need for bleachness of it and like the hairline in general like y'all look at this hairline i feel like it is literally everything and you can't really see it that well because of the pink right there but i just feel like this unit was done just like perfect like it really was the pre-styling all of that stuff with this wig is just all freaking pros to me so those are my pros with this unit okay so would i recommend this wig yes i personally would and i would recommend it because I feel like with this unit, it came pre-style. It's just the ultimate beginner friendly when you want to try something different. And it's not too, too much. It is still extra. It's still pink on black hair. But it's not like super extra like uh, the other pink skunk stripe thing that I did. This one, you can definitely cover it up way easily and just have like more of a pick -a boo if you you know, uh, part the unit in a different way. Like you could literally part it on this side and go over there and the pink would just be pick -a -boo. So that makes the unit more versatile to me. And yeah, I, I just, overall, I would definitely recommend this wig. All right, honey, let's get into this 4360 so we can wrap this thing all the way up. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. So yeah, y'all, let me know down below what you guys think about this unit. Let me know if you are feeling it as much as I am. I am interested in hearing you guys' thoughts and opinions. Sound off down below in the comments. Um, once again, shout out to you, Y Wigs, for sending me this unit. I truly appreciate it. And if you are interested in this wig, I will have a direct link down below in the description box for your convenience. And yeah, girl. <laughs> That's all. That's all.
So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, come feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, girl, click that subscribe button. It's not going to cost you not one red cent. And if you're not already following me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and TikTok. I'm Hell to Miss C on Snapchat, and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love bugs, next time. Bye.